four. We're on our way to Grand Rapids, Michigan. It's about a four hour drive. It's gonna be a good day. We're gonna meet up with uh, all the guys in We Came As Romans and Crown the Empire and Era. Bunch of good, bunch of good buddies. We're still in Milwaukee. Last night's show was insane. But yeah, we're gonna head our way to Grand Rapids. We're playing at the intersection tonight. We get a little shorter. We play a 40 minute set tonight instead of our hour and a half headliner because we're meeting up with another tour. So, I don't know, I'm just really excited. It's gonna be a fun day. Just getting to see a bunch of old homies, you know? Oh, but you don't wanna go. Get in. I'm taking one because I have a snare drum in it. And then I just gotta take these. This stuff and that's it. Alright everybody, welcome to the intersection in Grand Rapids, Michigan. I've been so excited for this show in particular because there's a bunch of friends on this one. And we only had to play a 40 minute set. It sucks for you guys, but it's good for me. I'm gonna put this kit together and we'll start ripping, yeah? Play two stripped down songs and one sound check song, <coughs> so they get to see what it's like to you know sound check and stuff like that. So also we come down, hang out, just like old buds, you know what I mean. If we're coming to your city, check out that VIP upgrade, and you know come hang out. Here they come, the VIPs. Come around the corner and say what's up to you guys. Let's see who we got over here. I'm going in solo. <laughs> I'm going in solo right now. Alright. Let's say hi to all these guys. Yo, what's up everybody? How you guys doing? What up? Say hi to the vlog. Hey vlog. Say hey to the vlog. What up guys? We got Wee Car doing their meet and greet right now. Doing a little trivia. Which member of the band's dad plays a mean banjo? Whose dad plays the banjo? Just come back, just for the fucking comeback. I got it, alright, just come back. Did somebody leak this on the internet? You guys are too smart. Is this even hard work to do, Vince, at all? You're pretty much just folding clothes. I, Pretty much it, right? Well, it's a good thing I went to school for retail. I worked at American Eagle in high school so I could buy girl pants at a discounted rate. Oh, let's check out today's spread. What do you think? Mm. Well, it was nice and sunny out earlier when we got here. But, uh, I mean, now we're done loading in. Done with our meet and greet. Got all our gear stashed. Figure out a new set. We had to redo our whole set on the computer and you know get together and, and figure out you know pick the songs that we want to play and the ones we hope you guys want to hear but today is one of my favorite days on the road and it is roadie friday and what roadie friday is no matter what day of the week it is if you're on tour and you have a day off the next day we call it roadie friday all of you guys that follow me on instagram and stuff know that i've been like on a weight loss journey I've been killing it still on this tour. I've been doing great, not drinking, not doing anything bad, no soda, no candy, nothing that you shouldn't put into your body, you know what I mean? What I've decided to do, because even at home I do a cheat meal, so, or a cheat day, I'm gonna use Roadie Friday as that day. And especially a day like today with all the friends, I'm gonna throw back a couple beers. And I'm probably gonna have like a cheeseburger with some bread on it, man. It could get real crazy tonight. I don't, I don't know what's gonna happen. I know I don't have to drive tonight, so, you know, the world is my oyster right now. I can do whatever I want. I'll try and keep it PG though for, for all the kids out there. All right. 
Look at where I was hanging out. I think I think that is literally poop in the corner. That's straight up poop. Look at this. Oh god. Yeah. That's poop for sure. Now I know what you're thinking. Matt. Matt, you're wearing the same clothes you've worn in the last two vlogs. And you know what I have to say to that? Tour life, bro. And I keep getting so many compliments on this sick legato shirt. So. And also, I'm not seeing you guys get the hell out of here with that shit. Looks like we got a we got a line tonight, boys and girls. And a line go from here all the way. You can't. Oh, yep, you can see it all the way down there. Yo, so if any of you guys in Grand Rapids came to the show, look for yourself in the vlog, yo. So I'm out here just getting some B-roll footage. I was thinking just after after doing the first vlog and then right now I'm currently editing the second vlog. Just after doing that, I kind of realized that I don't really you guys don't really get a feel for like where I'm at. I'm just walking around Grand Rapids right now, just trying to like find cool stuff to try and like bring you guys into like the vibe of, you know, wherever I am. So we're work we're working our way up to New York right now. And then we fly to Europe from there. You guys definitely want to catch all the Europe stuff. Like every time we go to Europe, it's such a great time. No offense, and this isn't to every every US venue, but man, I, you get way more taken care of in Europe, dude. There's just so much more like, the architecture. There's so much more history. I feel like like knights fought and battled, and like blood was spilled in the streets of these like old cobblestone pathways and stuff and there's like castles and huge churches. I don't know, it's just really cool. It's so, so cold. Another thing dude, when I left this tour, I thought like, I was expecting it to be coming up on spring, but it's been fucking cold as shit everywhere I go. I'm like doing my best to ignore the fact that I'm talking to a camera and there's like people around watching me right now. Yeah, dude, I did not. This is the only jacket I brought. That's all I have. It's so cold. I think it's like 38 degrees right now and my hand is just frozen. I'm just gonna continue to get some B roll out here. And like I said, just make it feel like you guys are here with me, you know? That's the goal. That's the goal here. Like, it's me and you. It's me and you guys, and we're going on this adventure around the world together. I'm gonna give you guys a little. Oh, what up? This is Drew Sullivan. What up, what up Drew? You're in the vlog. Say hi to everybody. Hi, everybody. All 1,000 subscribers. Homies. I toured with him when he was an Eye the Breather a long time ago and uh, been good buds ever since. But I'm going to show you guys our green room today. We're sharing our green room with We Came As Romans, the, uh, the all-time homies. And what do you know, it's empty and that never happens. Intersection. It's a great venue, man. It's such a great venue though. Like, you can't even tell that sex has happened right there. You know what I mean? Like other venues, you can definitely tell, right? You can attest. You can tell when there's been a couch that's been put on. There's been a few sexual relations. Guys, I done goofed. I wanted to get a sick shot of the line and doors had already opened, so I missed the entire line. There's about a quarter of it left. And I'm not just saying that to make it sound like, oh, it's the biggest show ever, I'm serious. Let's see what's good.
you little giblets? Thank you all for tuning in. It's a wrap here at the intersection in Grand Rapids. It was such a great show. So good seeing everybody that uh, you know we've all toured with in the past. It was like a real treat to get to uh, see everybody and play with everybody again. So yeah, man, it's been real. Catch you next time. Peace.